Today's video is going to be slightly different from normal and in a slightly different in a couple of key ways. For starters, we're not going to be talking about a member of a brass family. We're instead going to be talking about a member of the woodwind family. It happens to be made out of brass, but that's not that's sort of beside the point. The second thing that makes this video a little bit special is that I think this regardless of what family it comes from, is the most beautiful, sexy, if you will, student grade instrument I have ever felt, touched, held in my hands. This thing is really a sight to behold. Recently on my channel I have reviewed a number of instruments that have been sent to me from the TomTop website and this is the latest instalment. This is a student grade saxophone, the brand is Laid, L-A-D-E and uh, as I mentioned before this is perhaps the most good looking student grade instrument I have ever seen. Instead of just being brass coloured or silver plated or being one of those crass fluorescent colours sometimes you see on student instruments. This here is a very stunning red bronze brushed finish uh, that has been applied to a just a standard brass underlay and even the finger buttons are uh, what they call abalone but what here in New Zealand we would call power shell design so you have these beautiful power finger buttons and they are all throughout the instrument as well and I think the the sort of red rose colored brushed bronze look to this the the power shell things makes this an instrument that I want to hold I want to have it it looks it looks expensive it looks nice it looks flash and when you're a young'un who's learning their way through music and is, you know not really able to make sounds that delight the ears or anything like that when you've got an instrument that is as visually appealing at least to my eye as this instrument it makes you want to play it it makes you want to practice um, and that is one of the uh, reasons why I like some student grade instruments they may not have a huge amount of musical value but the visual value of that instrument uh, is an encourage is a source of encouragement right in its own uh, you know in its own regard so the person that would buy this is the sort of person that's probably a parent uh, probably wants to encourage a younger child or a niece nephew or something like that into music uh, but that person themselves may not have a huge deal of inclination in that uh, direction um, and an instrument like this is a brilliant way to start I mean naturally I would recommend that you go for a brass instrument but you know not all apples fall from that tree and so this instrument here from the TomTop Tom website is I think a brilliant place to start not only do you get something that works you get something that is as I've said visually appealing but you get everything that you need to make a good go you don't have to buy anything else because another thing about this instrument is that it comes with more accessories and more things than I have ever seen in any other instrument that I've tried or any other instrument that I've got from new. So you get the instrument of course you get the long sort of rod that goes in the instrument when it's in bed asleep to prevent moisture uh, from getting around there you get a saxophone strap now this one's actually really cool because when you put it on you can actually tighten it and loosen it just by grabbing hold of this. You don't need two hands to tighten it and loosen it and I think that's really cool. Um, my neoprene um, strap for my other saxophone isn't like that and is not quite as good. Uh, you get the gloves, the sort of gratuitous gloves that don't fit anyone. You get a standard cleaning cloth, not one but two standard cleaning cloths, microfibery sort of things. You get a uh, weighted pull-through cloth. So this has got a little weight on the end of it. The idea is that you drop it in one end of the instrument, the weight goes through the end and you can just pull it out and that's all good with the world. You get a guide, a guide to some of Laid's other instruments and where you put your fingers and friends. So this page here is the sort of alto saxophones. You've got, you know, the, the silver plated one, the brass colored one, and then you've got white, black, 
red, pink, purple and blue. Those sort of colours, they look nasty. They, well, not the brass and silver plated ones, but the, these sort of coloured ones at the bottom, they look disgusting. I wouldn't want to buy one. Um, but, which is why I was so interested when I saw this one, because it does look so nice. You know, I'm waffling about that. But you've got the, the manual that comes with it. You've also got a saxophone mute. This thing here is the cheapest thing I've ever put my hands on, but it's made out of aluminium, 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 and um, you also, we're not finished there, you get a pack of 10 reeds, they're all the same size, and so this is probably my first criticism, is that if you're a new uh, learner, if you're a, somebody just starting an instrument, I'd actually recommend you get several different strength reeds. Uh, these are all two and a halves, and two and a half for me is not quite right um, and I'd recommend that you sort of had two or three of a, of a one and a half a two a two and a half a three etc just so you can get a feel for what works the best for you but you get 10 reads so that's plenty to start off with you get this which is it looks actually like a trombone mouthpiece brush but I guess you could also use it for the mouthpiece of this so you get that you get a second saxophone strap this one is just a no bells and whistles um, strap that you put around your neck it's got nothing nothing fancy about it but you get two of them um, and is that all? no that's not all you also get a bottle of cork grease so you can actually use this for brass instruments as well it's the same product but you can use this uh, to lubricate or to grease your cork um, and yeah you get a case you get a strap for that a shoulder strap for that case uh, it is a fantastic setup and that Pretty much you buy this, you're away going. Other than what I said about the reeds. If we return from the box of goodies that is the case and the accessories and return our focus to the instrument, uh, we can see that with a little bit of a closer inspection that this is actually a proper student grade instrument. It's not intermediate or professional or anything like that. And some of the clues that we see for that are things like the the, the felts that are at the bottom of some of these pads and, and, and stays and things. They're not cut very well. They've got bits missing out of them. They're quite rough. Uh, you can see some bits of adhesive and glue from some of them. So that's a little bit, you know, that's a little bit rough. When you actually go to play the instrument, some of the notes before the break and after the break are, are are out of tune with each other. I think of C's particularly. There's there's 20 or 30 cents um, tuning difference between a C before the break and the C um, above the break. And so that's a bit of a downside, but these are all things that you would expect to see with a student grade instrument, especially when you're only potentially looking at paying 260 odd dollars for something like this. The real value that I see instruments like this having, not just this specific one, but other instruments that are in this position in the market, is that um, if you're a youngster, if you're just wanting to learn an instrument, then having a really good instrument uh, or a second-hand Stradivarius or, or, or something like that that doesn't look very nice but plays really well is sort of lost a bit. When you're a young, uh, a young musician, then often the most exciting thing is having an instrument that looks the part, that makes you want to pick it up and play it. And that is something that this particular model really, really knocks out of the park. If you're interested in finding out more about this specific instrument, then the link to the TomTop website is down in the video description below. Thanks for watching.